Expresso and Dulux are in Heart Bay at the Domestic Animal Rescue Group, or DOG, headquarters. First, let's find out a bit more about the important work being done here. DOG is a no-kill rescue animal sanctuary, let's put it that way. We do adoptions, we do education and sterilizations here, but not for the public. And we have all sorts of different animals. And of course, we've got our 120 dogs and 250 cats. They're all in cat gardens. Founded 17 years ago, the organization offers a clean and comfortable haven for homeless pets. Dulux color expert Sonica Bachsteg believes a lick of paint can brighten the day of any humans and canines alike. I did some research on dogs um, because a lot of people believe that dogs are colorblind, which they are in a sense, but they can actually see some color from the blue spectrum. So the colors that I've chosen, I believe, will not have a negative effect on the animals, but also in a way to create an environment where when people come to view the animals, to create a happy environment, which actually assists them to get the animals adopted. Three, two, one, one let's go! <laughs> Basically decided to use a Dulux tough coat for the floors. What we have done is we've also taken up the tough coat about half a meter up onto the wall, you know, so that it's easy to clean. And then for the rest of the walls, we've used luxurious silk, which is, um, you know, it's, it's a stunning product. It's, um, it's very durable, tough, easy to clean. And I'm sure that this, you know, that the walls will look great, you know, for many years to come, you know, even with all the cleaning and everything. Sonica and the volunteers worked with a plan. The correct order for painting any space is to start with the ceiling, then the walls, and finally the wood and metal work. Baba, four-legged presenter, also lent a paw. The walls are painted previously with a high-gloss enamel. The high-gloss enamel is um, too smooth to paint on without a primer, so we use Super Grip to apply a primer, and Super Grip dries in two hours, so you can still apply the top coat in the same day, So, which saves you a lot of time on labor, and the job can go quicker for the client as well. It's a water-based paint, um, so the, the films are much lower than your oil-based paints. Um, you can also use it in children's rooms um, because it's so washable. It took the 12 volunteers the better part of a week to prep and paint the space. The end result, worth it. For one thing, it's nice bright colours and it uh, brightens up the place. It gives everybody a lovely feeling when you walk into something that's nice and happy. And The dogs have got fantastic uh, kennels now and they've been painted. And, oh, we're so excited about it. I think it'll make a great difference to the public when they come in and see what a happy place it is. Well done, Dulux. Read more on dog.org.za on how you can help save an animal from hunger or adopt a pet. Well, the world's famous dog is in studio with us. And of course, South Africa's famous dog, Bob, is in studio as well. And he seems to be running around today on set. He doesn't <laughs> want to come near me. We do have his trainer on set, and I think he's just running after him. Uh, he might be scared that, uh, as a few people have mentioned on, on our Facebook page already, that um, the Dulux dog might uh, scare Bob, but he doesn't at all. They were actually playing together so nicely. Come here, Bob. Well, it doesn't look like he wants to come to us. So I tell you what, we've got Michelle, who's the owner of the Dulux Dog, in the studio today. Also from Dulux, we've got Benham here today. Guys, Morning, nice to see you. Nice to be chatting to, to the Dulux Dog, as you call him. Yes. What does it entail to be the Dulux Dog? Well, he does get great, great pleasure out mm -hmm. of pleasing you, which I mentioned <laughs> earlier. So it's not very difficult. Um, basically, if he was doing a TV ad, he would get a storyboard a good couple of weeks beforehand to see if there's anything completely outrageous or new or carrying heavy paints of tin or something like that. <laughs> um, and then we would practice those things at home mm. every day with lots of treats and recognition. They do work, they, they don't mind treats, but they work for recognition. Yeah. They work for the way you react. Mm -hmm. So that's why they, they're great to work with. Mm. So we basically just go through the storyboard. By the time he gets to the set, he's been there, done it. He goes in and he does it. He can work with anybody as mm. long as that person uses the commands and they use it in the right tone. He has done adverts with little three-year-old kids Aww. running and hasn't pulled them over as long as he's spoken to properly. So, yeah. Now, they had lots of fun, the two of them, Bob and, yes. and the Dulux dog, meeting each other. They've even got their own Facebook pages. Yes. I think after the show, they're going to like each other's Facebook page. <laughs> What's the Dulux dog's Facebook page? The Dulux dog? Uh, it's fatsweek.com and then forward slash Dulux dog. So, yeah, I mean, he's just launched it, so you, know, you guys can go on and, and add it. And Bob uh, Frenchy yeah. as well. Look, they seem to be having loads of fun. Ben, in the relationship between the brand Dulux and the Dulux dog, okay. how did that start? 
Um, that actually started in the 1960s when they had the first dog appear in one of the Dulux ads. Mm. And like a loyal friend, he's stuck around forever. Mm. So definitely part of the brand and, and a big part of, of the icon and recognizing our brand. Now the first question you got from everyone, Michelle, when you arrived on set with him is, can he see? Yes, he can. <laughs> he can see we very far. We can't see him. He can see very far and he's got very, very hardy eyes. He's got beautiful shark's eyes, I always say. Uh, you could throw a ball and he would catch it before it bounced. Mm -hmm. Their hearing is unbelievable, their eyesight is unbelievable. They actually have an oil substance on their eyelashes, naturally, it's there, and that keeps all the hair away. The hair itself is sunglasses. That's, it just, sunglasses? Yes, it protects him from the environment. Mm -hmm. That's basically... Tell him about the Teflon. I was just yeah. wanted to say, <laughs> you made a great comment earlier, like that's, that. that's what makes it yes, the I perfect love, Dulux dog. I do, I love the fact that he is the Dulux dog, <laughs> and he has an, his undercoat is completely waterproof. Mm. Davis, well, sorry, the Dulux dog, will get <laughs> horribly filthy. He'll go and swim in the Langevin beach, and he'll come out and is terrible. And people go, oh my word, hours ahead of you. No. He goes to bed and he wakes up the next morning and all that mess is on the floor. No. And I just got to give him a quick brush through to get any excess hair out. Mm -hmm. And he's all beautiful again. So it's just like the paint, the washable and all the dirt just washes off, which is fantastic. <laughs> so we love that. I See, love that. Ideal match for the it brand. It is an ideal match. <laughs> and you've got a great competition running and it closes today. Today's the last day. So yeah, win a trip promotion that we're running in store. Mm -hmm. um, buy any Dulux product and you can stand a chance to win a trip overseas to one of three colorful destinations. Where uh, do you get to go? Turkey, Istanbul. Um, and yeah, and, and today's the last day, so get in store and, and uh, buy any Dulux product. And I know if you go into store, you just need to SMS the, the, and the barcode. SMS your barcode. 33383. And that's it. So it's as easy as that. Uh, what other promotions are you running throughout the year? Um, there are quite a couple, Liesl. Um, there's some nice things coming up in the future. Mm -hmm. um, for now, this is the big one, the big focus, and we're very excited to be revealing the, the winner for this one very soon. The Let's <laughs> Colour. So go out to your nearest store, go pick up a tin of Dulux paint, SMS the barcode to 33383. The competition closes today. And we've got our two dogs on set. Uh, Bob is having a field day with the Dulux dog. Dulux uh, dog has his own Facebook page. It's facebook.com forward slash Dulux dog. So go and lick or like his page <laughs> <laughs> and I believe Bob's gonna like it as well come here Bob you want to like his page come boy come not come like it's it not edible no <laughs> I know I'm supposed to spoil him with food but he ate all the chicken <laughs> well we're gonna get Bob a uh, uh, Dulux dog to like Bob's page as well it's expressly here on SABC 3 Michelle Benham thanks so much for Thank joining you, us Lisa. and bringing in our Dulux dog I think we'll leave the two of them to go play now a tonal colour scheme that's using varying shades of the same colour is a great way to create a balanced and calm room. Sonica shows us how it's done. The tonal scheme is probably the easiest colour scheme of all. So first of all, I take the scatter cushion to the Dulux wall of colour. I've found a colour that matches the dark colours, Red Stallion. But you will notice that there's not a lot of tonal difference with this colour. Invert the card to see how the shades go together. Using the lightest tone on the ceiling gives the illusion of space. Referring back to my cushion, I would then use Red Stallion 3 for my feature wall, the mid-tone colour for my broad walls, and the lightest colour for ceiling and trim. And that is how easy it is to create a tonal colour scheme. Using this technique, you can create a vivid but not overpowering look.